I am Anil Kumar sharing with you a test question on limits. The question here is find limit when x approaches 1 for x cube minus 1 divided by absolute value of x minus 1. You can always pause the video, answer the question and then look into my suggestions. Now in this particular question we will use two things that is how to factor x cube minus 1 right. So that is one thing we could factor x cube minus 1 as x minus 1 times x square plus 1x that is x plus 1 square which is 1 right so that is how we can factor this the second part is to redefine the absolute function as a piecewise function right so, so absolute value of x minus 1 could be written as positive value of x minus 1 when x minus 1 is greater than or equal to 0 or when x is greater than or equal to 1, right? x minus 1 greater than or equal to 0 or when x is greater than 1. If I write 1, it becomes 0, right? So, and it is equal to negative of this value when x is less than 1. So, that is how we could actually redefine this function, right? So, we can write this as a limit for this function as two different pieces, right? So, one is, let me write this as combination of two functions in this form. So one will consider when x is less than 1, the other one when x is greater than or equal to 1, right? If x is less than 1, the function is minus of x minus 1, right? Uh, that is, I mean, absolute value of x, right? Uh, this is the absolute value of x minus 1 equal to, right? In this case, absolute value of x minus 1 is equals to x minus 1, correct? Now, based on this, we'll rewrite this particular question, right? Let me change the ink. So, we can write this as, when x is less than 1, it is limit x approaches 1 from the left side, minus, right? And x cubed minus 1 could be written in this form, right? Which is x minus 1 times x square plus x plus 1 divided by, now this absolute value, on the negative side is negative of x minus 1, correct? On the other hand, when x is greater than or equal to 1, we could write this as limit x approaches 1 from the positive side and the numerator is x minus 1 times x square plus x plus 1 divided by x minus 1. Do you get the idea? Since this is positive, right? Now if you see this, we could actually cancel out x minus 1 from numerator and denominator but in this part we are left with negative value do you see negative of this and here when x is approaching 1 from the right side we have positive of this so when i substitute 1 here i get what i get negative value of 1 square which is 1 plus 1 plus 1 which is negative 3 right on the other hand, if I substitute x equals to 1 from the right side, I get 1 plus 1 plus 1, which is equals to positive 3. Now, since the limits are not equals, since the limit x approaches 1 from the left side, let me call this as a function f of x, right, uh, of this function is not equal to limit when x approaches 1 from the right side, of this function we say limit does not exist okay so the limit does not exist when x is approaching 1 for the given function so we can see this limit does not exist right since the limits from the left side is not equal to the limit from the right side I hope that is clear thank you and all the best